If you're working in a biochemistry department of a large pathology organization and the word osmometer means something to you, you're going to want to pay attention to the next few minutes. Hi, I'm Andre from the John Morris Group and today we're here to talk about the latest osmometer innovation from Advanced Instruments, the Osmo One. The Osmo One from Advanced Instruments is perfect for aqueous samples in clinical laboratories that test small sample volume and require an osmometer that offers ease of use, accurate and precise results, secure and efficient electronic data management. And let's swing this thing around and have a look at some of the features that it offers that I know you're gonna love. The Osmo One features a touchscreen menu-driven operating system, integrated barcode scanner for traceable sample identification, and reduction of transcription errors. No more writing in a notepad. You've got built-in quality control, and the unit allows for QC data over time with exportable Levy Jennings charts. So again, no manual data recording. The Osmo One will issue a warning when QC is out of range, so users can react in real time and it stores the last 1,000 test records and 10,000 events. You've got electronic data management for security and efficiency. You've got bi-directional LIS via Ethernet connectivity, and the Osmo One provides statistical data analysis, including mean, standard deviation, and coefficient of variation. It's really important to make sure you're taking good care of your osmometer. And one of the ways that you can know if things aren't going quite to plan is whether or not you end up with more chamber cleaners or more sample tips. If these two boxes seem like they're out of alignment, it's probably fair to say that maybe you aren't cleaning the chamber in between each run, or perhaps you're reusing old and used chambers, chamber cleaners. So to have a look at how we actually clean the, the chamber, what we do is we take one of these, we simply place it up here into the actual probe, and we rotate it left and right six times. And then we know we've actually gone successfully because in the end here, we'll have a small indentation. If you're not gonna use the osmometer for a little while, it's always best to reverse the chamber cleaner over and leave it right up into the actual probe assembly itself. And what that does is it stops any moisture or any any uh, environmental dust from collecting up there in the delicate measurement areas. So let's have a look at how we do a run. Firstly, all advanced osmometers are provided with a pipette similar to this one right here. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take a 290 standard and I'm gonna show you how the unit works. So we're gonna pipette that standard up. And if you can see there at the end, that's fairly clean. We've got no liquids around the outside of the pipette tip, so we don't need to clean that sample. What we're gonna do is we're gonna place it directly into the unit, and we're gonna load it. And the unit will now begin. Wow, 292 on a reference standard of 290. In a minute and six seconds, you won't even have a chance to make yourself a cup of coffee. So swinging the unit around, you can see here, here's our LAN connection for our LIS, or you can download your data straight to a USB. So that's the latest innovation in single sample osmometry from Advanced Instrument. And this particular unit really is saving lives. If you've got any questions about the Osmo One, please ask us below. Don't forget to like our channel and thanks for watching. Bye for now.